pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> the return of Ruby Sparkle. Ruby Sparkle ran as fast as she could, trying to save the royal jewels from Gertrude the Big Greedy Goblin, who wanted to gobble them up. <gasps> oh no! Poor Ruby! Turn the page, Hazel! No! I can't look! I can't not look! Next page, Hazel! I don't know. I want to see what happens to Ruby, but then I sort of don't want to see it. But mostly I do. But that no good goblin tricked poor Ruby into falling through a trap door. And she slid down, down, down into a dark, dirty dungeon. <gasps> oh no! Poor Ruby Sparkle. She sure could use a break. You're right, Posy. Ruby needs a break. Let's check Spellopedia. Here we go. How to spell a character out of a storybook. Hurry! R Ruby's still in the dungeon. Sparkle up, Charmers! We wave our wands! We play our wands! We pour our special potions! We sparkle up and cast a spell in a single charming motion! Sparkle up, Charmers! Bibbledy bobbledy gobbledy gook! Free poor Ruby from the dungeon in her book! I'm sure I'm not in a dungeon anymore. And you guys don't look like jewel-stealing goblins. You look like charmers. Ruby! Ruby! We thought you needed a break from all that goblin-y, dungeon -y stuff. Maybe you'll even come up with a plan to get the jewels back from Gertrude. That's really nice of you, charmers. Thanks. Adventure, here we come! So, what do we do now? Want to go outside and play until you're ready to go back in your storybook? Sounds great. Beats goblin chasing any day. Then follow us! <laughs> Sparklies? Mm, Sparklies! <laughs> Magic jump rope is charmazing! It'll be even charmazinger when we add all our pets. Seven! Treble flare! Hop in! One and two and three and four. We all want to. Oh, oh. Ouch! That almost sounded like... Gertrude the Goblin! <gasps> Sparklies! <laughs> Please. <laughs> That's enough sparkle goblin, Gertrude. Goblin, be gone! Um, Ruby, I don't think your storybook wand works here in Charmville. Remember? Oh, right. <laughs> Sparkly. <laughs> we have to go after her. Anybody have a spare magic wand? Here, Ruby. Adventure, here we come! Ruby! And a broomie for Ruby, please. <laughs> Sparkly. Hold on, Gertrude. Those aren't jewels. Right. They're pretty flowers, and they belong to everybody. Hmm. Sparklies? <laughs> Sparklies. <laughs> Charmers, here's a quick tip about greedy gem goblin goblins. They just don't listen. Sorry, Gertrude. I'm sending you back to the storybook. Bibbledy, bobbledy, gobbledy, gah! <laughs> she ate my spell? <laughs> if sparkle magic doesn't work, maybe my potion power will. Plus my music magic. <laughs> Sparkly! What happened to my twinkly sunflowers? I was gonna water them. <laughs> Sorry, Charmer Farmer. I think it's time to tell the Enchantress we let a goblin loose in Charmville. Oh, hi, Sally Sweetly. No, I'm afraid the Enchantress was called away to the Enchanted Sea. <laughs> so, what can this broom maker do for you? A goblin got all your sparkleberry ice cream? Oh, dear. Oh, excuse me, I have another call. Hello? A goblin sucked up all your sparkly shoelaces? 
Are you sure it was a goblin? They're only found in storybooks. Ah! Or are they? Hmm. I'll have the Enchantress get back to you, Mr. Twinkletoes. Mom's not here, huh? Because, well, we sort of accidentally released a goblin from a storybook into Charmville. Hi. Oh, hi, Ruby. And she really, really loves sparkly stuff. Really. Gertrude, the goblin. And she's loose in a town full of sparkles and twinkles and, oh, Hazel. You might want to hide Mom's royal tiara. Right. That's the sparkliest thing in Charmville. Hello? Wild guess? Goblin problem? Gertrude just sucked the sparkle roof off the candy shop. Sounds like she's headed for the sparkle stream. We're on our way. Don't worry, Dad. We'll stop her before she eats all the sparkles in Charmville. Ooh, sparkles. Hey, I was painting those sparkles. Sparklies. <laughs> Goblin? Yes, unfortunately. I, I wanted to paint the sparkly stream, but now it's just the stream. <gasps> Aren't you Ruby Sparkle? I, I just love your books! Adventure, here we come! Thanks, but my latest adventure accidentally came here. We've got to find that goblin and get her back in the book before she unsparkles all of Charmville. Gotta go! Bye! Bye. Any sign of a glitter goblin goblin? Is it me or is Mount Sparkle more a teensy bit less sparkly? That's gotta be Gertrude. Then we have to go stop her. Oh my goodness. Hazel, you won't believe what just happened. Um, something to do with a big greedy goblin? Yes, she just marched in and gobbled up all our sparkles. <laughs> Sounds like Gertrude. Uh-huh. Do you have any idea how much work it'll take to re-sparkle an entire mountain? We're super sorry, fairies. But right now, we need to stop that sparkle slurper-upper. Did you see which way she went? Charmville. Where else? There's plenty of sparkly stuff down there. There won't be for long unless we hurry. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> Royal Tiara, we've got to find you a goblin-proof hiding place. Ah, done. Oh, my first place broom-making trophy. I better find a safe place for this, too. That's probably more charm villers with sparkle-stealing stories. It's not easy filling in for the Enchantress. Be right there. Sparklies. Hey, that's mine! Sparkly! Oh, guess it's time to call the Enchantress. <laughs> Wait, the... Oh. Dad, Gertrude the Goblin was headed this way. Did you hide the royal tiara? Don't worry, your mom's crown is safe. But that goblin stole my broom-making trophy and my mirror phone. And the sparkles right off my socks. That's Gertrude for you. She'll go after anything sparkly. Then maybe that's how we can get her back in the storybook where she belongs. I have a plan. To the Charm House! Come along and fly with us. Uh -huh. To the Charm House, everyone. Come on, it's where the fun never ends. It's all about the magic of best friends. To the Charm House! Thanks again for helping, Willow. You're charmazing with arts and crafts. You're the best! For sure! It all looks so good! I do love arts and crafts. And if it works, it'll be a sparktastic ending to another Ruby Sparkle adventure. What should I paint the roof with? Hmm, something super sparkly to catch that goblin's eye. Hazel might want to add a little more glitter around the windows. Got it! And Posy, Ruby, maybe paint more flowers by the front door. More flowers coming up! Love this plan! Love these colors! Oh, this is the most sparktacular paper castle I've ever seen. Thanks, Willow! Couldn't have done it without you. 
Using sparkle bait to lure Gertrude into a trap is a great idea. You could write a Ruby Sparkle book, Hazel. Thanks, Ruby. I just hope our greedy goblin Gertrude falls for it. Sparklies. <laughs> Sounds like she did. Storybooks in place. Everybody hide. <gasps> Sparklies. <laughs> Nibbledy, bobbledy, gobbledy, gook. Send Goblin Gertrude back to her book. Now it's time for me to finish my story. Adventure, here I come! Bye, Ruby! <laughs> so with the help of her amazing friends, Ruby Sparkle tricked the jewel-eating goblin, and everyone lived happily ever after. <laughs> Cozy bird. <laughs> Pretty birdie houses, not for pesky mouses. La 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 la. <laughs> <laughs> charm scouts, your birdie houses look charm amazing. We're going to earn our animal friendship charms for sure. Thanks, Hazel. But it was your sparktastic idea. Yeah. And who knew making bird houses could be so stylish? We just have to finish them up and wait for a birdie to make it their home. Then we get our charms. And what bird wouldn't want to live in one of these? I know, Lavender. I can totally see a charm bird hatch her little eggs in that sweet little house you made. <laughs> oh, thanks, Posy. But what about yours? It's a birdie dream house. <laughs> Thanks. It's the charmiest. Triple gave me some good ideas. Maybe I should add a swing to mine too. Or you could finish the roof. Right, the roof. I'm trying to make mine the hugest, most fantastic birdhouse ever. But it's not going very well. Get my charm scout charm. Uh oh, are those sparkle birds? <gasps> Snapdragons! I think they're coming this way. They must be looking for sparkly things to make their nests. Oh no! Maybe if I fix my birdhouse fast, they won't go after our broomies bristles. Sparkle birds just love using broom bristles for their nests. Emergency magic coming up. Nesty Westy, Sparkle Birdie, make this mess as sparkleful as Posy. <laughs> Snapdragons, it didn't work. And look, the first Sparkle Bird's already here. <laughs> well, at least you like your new home, don't you, little sweetie face? Um, where'd Posy go? Oh no. Yep. You accidentally hazeled her. <laughs> she says the house is nice, but it could use more sparkles. I'm glad, Posy. A uh, bird? But you're not really a bird. We've got to reverse this spell to the charm house. <laughs> Okay, how to undo an accidental bird spell? I don't know, Hazel. It says we need three charmers to reverse this magic. We have three charmers. One of us just has feathers and a beak. <laughs> Let's try. <laughs> I mean, Posy, Birdie, shoot! <laughs> Oops. Join their flock? 
not really a bird. It's just a spell that's going to wear off. Soon, I hope. <laughs> she says she knows she's a charmer, but right now she just can't help acting like a bird. We'd better keep an eye on her. Broomies! <laughs> is Posey. I can't tell. They all sparkle and they all tweet. And soon they're going to start looking for stuff to make their nests with. Huh? Bad Sparkle Bird, leave my Ruby bristles alone! Whoa! Whoa! Huh? Wait! Nah, uh uh Birdie. Hey! Whoa! You know, if you want to join our room polo team, just ask. <laughs> oh, whoa! Uh oh! Yes. Sparkle oh. birds! Whoa! Oh, those are our bristles. Get them back! Come on, guys! After those sparkling bees! Whoa. <laughs> Toadstools! We've got to get those bristles back. Better fly on half broomy power. Here you go, ma'am. Your brand new broomy 3000. All polished and ready to fly. Uh-oh, the sparkle birds are back. Better get flying now. No, stay away from my bristles, you stupid birds. <laughs> the sparkle birds stole your broom bristles, Mrs. Green Sparkle. But it's that time of year, and they love broom bristles because it makes their nest sparkle. I'll be right there. Oh! Uh-oh. Whoopsie! Oh, no. <sighs> sparkle birds. Again. That doesn't sound like the Sparkle Bird song. Almost like something Posy would make up. Posy? Oh, Hazel, I can't wait to hear how you explain this one. Um, about that, Mom. I sort of accidentally misspelled Posy into a Sparkle Bird. I kind of figured something like that happened, Hazel. Fortunately, your spell should wear off pretty soon, and we'll have one less sparkle bird. Coming for room! Hi, honey! See you at dinner! Okay, dear. Meanwhile, we've got to find some way to stop those sparkle birds before they break any more broomies. If I could just talk to Posy, maybe she could tell the other birdies to stop plucking our bristles. Good idea, Hazel. But which one is she? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. What a great way to get Posey's attention, Treble. Posey! She says she's really sorry about all the trouble she and her friends have caused. That's okay. But sparkle birds just have to have our broom bristles to make their nests. I understand. They need someplace sparkly and safe to lay their eggs. Safe and sparkly! We were already making birdhouses, but what if we made them so super sparkly they wouldn't need our broom bristles anymore to make their nests? That's a sparkling idea, sweetie. Yeah! But we'll need a lot of help to make all those birdhouses. Come on! We're gonna earn our animal friendship charms for sure! <laughs> Pretty birdie houses, not for pesky mouses. Welcome all you sparkle tweeties, lots of room to hatch your sweeties. Great work, birdhouse builders! And Posy says her birdie buddies are going to love living in Sparkle Town. <laughs> Keep 
She's going to tell the other Sparkle Birds to check out Sparkle Town. We did it! They love their new houses! Well done, honey. Your idea was a broom saver, Hazel. Way to go, Hazel. Bye. Posy Bird says everyone in the flock has a house now except for her. Posy already has a perfect nest. Her room at the Charm House is already sparktastically bird friendly. You're right. Follow us, Posy Bird. See, Posy Bird? It's the perfect place for a little birdie to call home. Treble says she'll even share her swinging perch with you. Looks like Posy's tuckered out from all her wing flapping today. Yeah, let's let her sleep off her magic spell. <laughs> Uh-oh, what was that? <laughs> hey, Charmers! Posy! You're Posy again! It was fun being a sparkle bird, but... Not as much fun as being a charmer. Oh, look! The animal friendship charm! You earned it! Wow! And I got one, too! And I got one, three! <laughs> Don't tell me you're turning back into a sparkle bird. <laughs> Just kidding. But I do have a sudden craving for birdseed. <laughs> <Ugh. laughs> 